My life revolves around brushing my teeth. This song seems powerful, but I don't love fall. I just love pears. That's frustrating. Double as cute as what I would ever come up with. <sighs> this is a collection. Literally everything I'm putting in here is a fruit. I think I just need a major routine switch up. It's 11.40 p.m. I'm gonna wake up tomorrow morning, and the first thing I'm gonna do is go on a walk. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go to bed. I'm <laughs> Those are the first words I said today. Ignore how I put on my scarf, my hair scarf. To be entirely honest with you, I am dreading this walk a bit. I know it's gonna be cold out and I actually have to leave my house again this morning um, to pick up some prints. All right, I think I'm officially out of sunscreen. I'm really excited to have the prints. I think that's the last thing I need before I start mounting everything. It's just some of my frames are just way heavy that I think I might also need nails. Let me get ready for my walk. Technically, I already messed up because I didn't wake up and go outside, but like, I feel like I have to prep for the winter time. Oh, cause it's shutter. I've been fiddling with my camera settings, trying to figure out why I seem so dark and my camera sets a shutter priority and I had my blinds open. So like, I just needed to close my curtains. Sometimes it's hard. <laughs> I would love to have a conversation with someone about the order of operations here because just me personally, I cannot start my day without brushing my teeth first. I am not willing to talk to anyone if I haven't brushed my teeth. I am in a bad mood if I don't brush my teeth. I actually sleep poorly if I don't brush my teeth before I go to bed. Like all my good days and all my bad days are surrounding me brushing my teeth. But I do remember watching a Monet McMichael video and she was just like, there are some days where she just doesn't brush her teeth. And she's not the first person I heard say that, but it still baffles me. I never saw brushing my teeth is something that I did for other people like it wasn't like a socialism thing it was always just like my mouth feels weird let's get the gunk out pause <laughs> I'm procrastinating now I do want to discuss with some of the order of operations here I need to brush my teeth every morning and then also I'm hungry already I'm someone who one of the first activities I do every morning is like eat breakfast should I make breakfast now because I'm already hungry and I don't want to go on this walk thinking about food but then by the time I eat breakfast finish it I can walk off my breakfast I think I'm just gonna go for a quick walk I don't think I'm gonna go too far I know the whole point of this walk is to like take in the sun but I will be wearing sunglasses because this sun this sun seems powerful I kind of want to go to the supermarket I don't have any fruit and it'd be so nice to have fruit I can think about this on my walk my stomach is growling level of hungry pears strawberries dragon fruits orange ball peppers pomegranates blueberries spring mix, onions bananas and cucumbers that's the whole in bulk and then I freeze them for when I need a quick breakfast mm, I'm gonna make eggs I just cooked my eggs and wasn't recording <laughs> but as you can see your girl will be eating I hope that was caught on camera but my reflexes tend to be really great so when i have videos of me like fumbling it that's like so embarrassing it's kind of like my reflexes are camera shy and i don't really like that i don't like that perception of me i think my reflexes 
are a hidden talent of mine because I'm so good at it that people don't notice that I'm good, you know? For breakfast today, we have scrambled eggs with pancakes, maple syrup, chocolate chips, and one of the pancakes has condensed milk on it. And I'm also gonna have pomegranates. I take ritual vitamins, magnesium, and elderberry gummies. And I'm almost out of elderberry gummies, so today might be the last day you're seeing them. I very much enjoyed that walk. I guess it wasn't a walk, it was a trip to the grocery store. But I think I need to ease my way into just going on walks. I did go without headphones, so I was alone with my thoughts. However, because I didn't eat breakfast, my thoughts were, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. My stomach is growling. I need food not very meditative <laughs> so i'm hoping in the future i can do a better job at just waking up and walking but knowing that walking immediately after waking up means i'm going to be hungry i should probably take a little bit of time to eat breakfast before i go on my walk i'll try that out next time i think i really need to commit to keeping my space clean i'm doing a pretty decent job but i think it's because i know i'm going to be recording like i know the aesthetics of a room is valuable when it comes to making content so maybe not having a messy room but also a messy room is relatable i relate to it <laughs> my room's always messy except for today somehow i'm already like so exhausted i woke up fine a little bit tired but i think that walk really stressed me out glad i did it and now that i'm back it's just like yeah that exerted a lot of energy and I haven't been working out as frequently, so I think I'm just like dead. That is not how I typically hold a fork. That's just how it was. The flavor of the eggs are starting to make me gag, so give me a second so I can inhale this last bite and just calm myself down. Fun fact about me, I don't like eggs. I remember I woke up one morning and the smell of eggs made me want to vomit and then I didn't eat eggs for a year. <laughs> and so eggs I'm like on and off about. So eggs like kind of gross me out but i need protein i'm a true american when it comes to my breakfast like give me dessert for breakfast i did in fact peel my pomegranate i was so excited for it i actually took a bite as i was peeling and each bite that i took tasted like chemicals so i think i might throw it in the fridge this is exactly what perfume tastes like it's so bad yeah that tastes like it's trying to kill me but i did finish washing the rest of the fruits so i am gonna have a pear because i didn't notice this gigantic gash in it and both of my pears have that so pears are genuinely one of my favorite fruits if not my favorite the only reason i love fall is because pears come back but i don't love fall i just love pears all right um i have a little bit of work stuff that i have to do i also need to go pick up my prints they're ready for pickup as of a half hour ago something i do want to do so if you watched my video yesterday i did make a bouquet in january that was my first and only bouquet I've ever made for myself. As I was making that bouquet, I realized I hated it. I realized I bought way too many flowers. It was great if I stopped at the roses and the pink flowers, but adding that third bouquet really, one, overcrowded the vase and made it just look wonky. So I want to redeem myself because that was not the prettiest, but it made me happy at the time and I was proud of myself and I think I can do better. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Yes, boom, that's good to go. Next. Okay, I'm lying, but then she fine. And um, and um. <laughs> Bring me your body, I'm a rockin' all night, uh. The way you rockin' that up in this love, that's why you are. <sighs> Bring me your body, I'm a rockin'. Mm -mm. Bring me your body up. Rock it all night. Bring me your body. I'm gonna rock it all night. I just sent my last email that I'm now waiting on replies before I can continue doing my job, which is perfect because it basically means that I have nothing else to do. So now I'm taking you with me to go pick up my posters. If we find some pretty flowers for less than 10 bucks, we'll pick them up. I know technically it's cheaper to just buy like a loaf of bread from the supermarket. However, I don't eat that much bread, so I'd rather just buy a roll whenever I need a roll, <laughs> which I feel like is more cost effective than trying to like inhale bread all the time. Mommy cookie. I also want to get into bread making because I feel like it's even more cost effective to make your own bread than it is to buy it in the first place. My skin is literally soaking up this lotion. It's like I never put on lotion a day in my life. 
oh my god and there's a period of time so my family has never just been a bread family we're not like eating sandwiches like crazy or at least from my perspective we haven't been so i'm just also not used to having bread in my home and there was one point where i had rice cakes but i didn't have bread but i had burgers and so i was just like let me just put the burger on the rice cake and it was like perfectly fitted to the rice cake the size of the burger and when i tell you it was a great experience and i put it on my instagram story and people were like that's so weird just in my household it's weird to have bread for some reason we had rice cakes and that was a great combo you have the crispiness of the rice cake and then the burger but like the textures of it i feel like you should just try it i feel like in explaining it i think i should just go buy rice cakes to make my burger i have to ask because i just finished talking about it would you try a burger on rice cakes i don't think it's that dramatic like people were viscerally angry about the fact that i was using rice cakes as buns i don't think it's that big of a deal it's like it's still Brain, and it added a different textural element. I don't think it's devious. I don't think it's malicious. I've done worse things in my life. Why can't I just eat a rice cake or two? <laughs> yeah, I think I think I'm convincing myself that I need to buy rice cakes instead of bread. Anyway, oh, I'm talking too much. Let me go do my errands. Ooh. I just went to go pick up my parents and they weren't ready. They were saying they were having a problem with the machine. So then he leaves, and when he comes back, I'm just like, how long is it gonna be? He's like a half an hour. Anyway, that's frustrating. Love you. Uh -huh. Excuse me, sir. Good. How much are for these? Oh, 20. 20? I'll get the 20 ones. I know I said I wasn't going to spend more than 10. It's really pretty, and I'm not going to find anything like these at the grocery store. Even when I'm with my boo, you know I'm crazy over you. No matter what I that was a very disorienting trip. It's snowing a little bit. The goal was Walgreens flowers rice cakes. Went to go find rice cakes. They didn't have rice cakes, so I did buy burger buns. Then I went back to check on my prints. They still didn't have it, but luckily I found a hardware store, so I bought nails so I can actually hang up my frames. And on my way to the grocery store, I found these flowers and I thought they were gorgeous. They were double what I wanted to spend. However, they're double as cute as what I would ever come up with. So I'm okay with just buying myself flowers. Let me show you the prints that I got. First, I got this flower vase and I think it's so pretty. You can see the iridescentness of it. These flowers are way too tall for this vase, but I will handle that a little bit later. It's Kirby! I love Kirby. I haven't watched any of the shows. I just love the look of him as a character. It makes me so happy. And if you don't know, there's this one photo of Kirby that has me laughing hysterically. It puts the biggest smile on my face. This photo and this photo alone is the reason why I love Kirby with all my heart. Long story short, in the late 2000s, early 2010s, on Facebook, it was a huge thing to have like gangster cartoon characters. So it'll be like gangster Bugs Bunny, gangster Tweety. And I was like, I wonder if they made a gangster Kirby. And that's how I found this photo, which by comparison, it's just so stupid. So here are the prints that I got. This like disco ball multicolored so this one is just simple good things are coming I really like balance again I'm a simple girl it just makes me happy oh my god I need to clean the frame, like the glass, but this makes me so happy. Oh, I'm so excited to put this on my wall. It's slipping out of the corner. It's not awfully noticeable, but it's definitely. I don't think I care that much. I feel like it's coming together. Let's look at the collection so far. Just a reminder, the goal is to judge these as a collection, not how well they go together. It's do they go together. It's a yes or no, right? Cool yeah 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 this is it this is a collection now that that's settled i'm gonna make my lunch this is what i'm gonna season my turkey burgers with
cook something other than spam on my channel? Like I gotta give you a taste test, come on. I am so close to absolutely perfecting my burger. I'm at a point now where it's just like, what are the toppings that will be like, oh my God, I'm craving a burger. One apple teeth. Mm -hmm. mm, mm -hmm. But I feel like dark leafy greens sometimes are like too bitter. So if you just hit it with some salad dressing, it's just a salad on a burger. Also, I think I'm one of the few people who will and can fuck up a salad willingly. Like it's not just like, oh, I'll have a salad. It's like, I'm craving a salad. Controversial opinion, underrated opinion. If I knew it was Palm's brand pomegranate, I wouldn't have bought them. I feel like buying brand name fruits other than Chiquita are trash. Best pomegranate I've ever had. Mm. So juicy. Okay. Okay. I have to gaslight myself to make sure that I eat my pomegranate seeds. On today's Angel's birthday, I didn't mention it, but it's true. I sang her happy birthday on my walk. I am going to finish up the work that I have and bring her over some fruit. If I'm going to be entirely honest, um, I feel a little bit more awake than I do typically on other when I don't walk at all but i also feel i'm feeling physically exhausted but mentally i'm a little bit more aware i've been in my body for majority of the day which is progress so i think being active did play a major part in that i think walking on a daily basis should be part of my routine the morning walk i think it's the order of operations that really threw me off i think walking coming back and then eating i guess it works up my appetite but i'm also i don't want to walk and think Oh, I'm so hungry. I want to walk and genuinely like get in tune with myself, figure out what's actually happening with my body, with my mind, with where my brain is at. So I think if I could figure out a routine that functions best for me, then I should be good. Morning walks is something I can incorporate into my routine. Definitely not first thing in the morning. That That's extreme. <laughs> I don't want to order food. So I'm gonna pack some veg and I'll pack some popcorn. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have a girl dinner. I call these vegetables when literally everything I'm putting in here is a fruit. <laughs> 